this truly is an impressive piece of kit. If you was off camping on a motorbike or car camping or taking the kids away camping for a weekend or going canoe camping um, or something like that, a, a quick trip away, three or four days, this thing would hold enough power and charge all your devices and run everything you need while you're away. It's a fantastic piece of kit. A bit of video editing for YouTube. Thought I'd come outside today. Do you like the view? Testing out this new power unit from Anchor. What an amazing piece of kit for its size. Anyway, better get on with the job. This is a really, really impressive little power supply or solar generator if you'd like to call it so this is the size of the unit I'll put the specs on the size and the weight of it shortly but this unit you could easily use for car camping canoe tripping and camping um, working outdoors working in the garden it's very versatile as well you can use it because you've got your 13 amp um, mains plug there and then you've got two USBs and a USB-C there and of course you have the obligatory car socket as well but it, as a unit it's just a really good size it's not heavy at all and as you've just seen in the video I put it in my rucksack and took it out on my motorbike so it'd be great for motorcycle camping as well and just give you enough power to charge all the stuff you need and run any laptops or anything or charge batteries telephones camera batteries whatever and this is the box it comes in five year guarantee which is excellent it's a 256 watt hour unit so something of this size to have so much power in is just so so impressive uh, we've got the UK one but they do have the CN I suppose it's China and the European sockets on them so if you're looking to buy this in a different country there make sure you get the right specification for your country it'll charge from flat uh, for MacBook Airs um, six devices can be charged at the same time. It will last like six times longer than a standard unit and that's because it's a lithium phosphate battery within this. So inside here is a very safe um, lithium phosphate battery and what this means about six times longer is every time you charge a lithium battery you lose some of its capacity slightly so in a standard one you might get 500 recharges from flat to full before you start to lose some capacity and it usually judges you down to about 80 percent but with this one you can do around 3000 or 3500 um, recharges from flat before you move down to 80% and even if you move down to 80% everything still works it's just the capacity will drop at that point so the longevity of this is excellent having those um, new batteries in here we are within the box you get a, an in-house charger so a charger that some people call them but the other good thing about this is a lot of chargers come with a massive charging unit but this one's just a small one like this so that plugs into your main socket and you can charge it from home it also comes with the in-car charging lead so this one plugs into your cigarette socket in your car or your camper van and it has the other socket on the back and they all fit into the DC input in the back of there for charging. To charge this from flat from using the mains adapter it'll take 4.1 hours. The USB-C is 4.3 hours. The in-car charging unit is 4.1 hours. The USB-C 
plus the inbox adapter you can charge it from flat to full in two and a half hours which is amazing for this piece of kit and of course solar panels um, it's got a built-in MPPT and that what that means is you just plug the solar panel into this you just need the solar panel and the relevant connectors and it'll plug in and that will take 4.1 hours to charge it full and the outputs in relation to this it's got a wall outlet so the mains outlet is 200 watts the USB-C is 60 watts max the USB-A is 18 watts and the car outlet, the cigarette socket unit, is 120 watts. So there's massive amount of power output as well. This, this device for its size has just got everything. And there it is, five year hassle free warranty as well. And more stuff on the box which is interesting. An iPhone 12, it will charge it 20 times. The MacBook Air Pro, sorry the MacBook Air 2020 It'll charge it four times, it'll run a fan for five plus hours and it'll run a pump, a compressor pump, for 4.8 plus hours. So ideal for car camping and tent camping, motorcycle camping or just generally out and about. Just plugged it into a solar panel. This panel didn't come with the unit but it will take a solar panel. That's an 120 watt solar panel. And this, you can't really see it on the display in the sun but the maximum input in this I think is 60 watts and 60 watts is going in there from the solar panel and it says on there it will be fully charged in 2.5 hours. This device also takes through charging so if you're putting 60 watts into this and you are taking out 40 watts it will just replenish what you're actually taking through which is a great way of through charging so if it's plugged into a solar panel, the mains adapter or into your car or any charging device into this unit it will actually transfer that through the unit the display is impressive on this there's a button here to switch the display on it actually tells you what the output of the um, unit is so it's currently running at 84 watts it says what input it is so I've currently got uh, 62 watts in and it tells you here that it'll last for three hours if you keep it at that consistency of uh, output. So the display is, is very good, very good indeed. Um, to switch the socket on the traditional car charger one, you press a button there. And to switch the mains, the three pin socket on, just like that, there's a little switch there. But these three, as I say, are USBs and they're on all the time but if you have this power saving switch on that's the device which will identify that the unit being charged by this socket is fully charged and switch it off. There's a light on there press it once you get a, a light and if you press it and hold it you get the old SOS distress signal. But this I know I've said it a few times through this video, but I've been using this for about a week and a half now and I've been using it around the house with my laptop and various other things. And this is an excellent piece of kit. I really, really like this piece of kit. The quality of it, the, the, the functionality of it and having the best battery in and the capacity it has for its size is just incredible. I'll explain the through charging again. Um, I've just plugged some uh, carry batteries in there and then I'm using the mains power supply to charge it. In this unit currently it says the output is 10 watts, the input is 63 watts, this is at 41% so this will is increase the capacity of the battery even though it's charging something and it will last 3.2 hours on its current situation but as the capacity charges with this the obviously this time here will extend so that's what I mean about through charging the power that's going in is more than the power that's going out so it'll still charge the unit as well as charging the bits that you're, you're charging from the USB. Just looking in the instruction book and here's something you don't see very often um, there's a email address for the service support and the social media links but there's also telephone numbers for around the world including a UK telephone number and when they're open. This is in the instruction book which is all the specifications if you want to freeze frame this you can see its weight and its size and the various outputs and capacities of things. Hope you enjoyed the video and we'll see you again soon.